guys think? Is that a person in that picture? Or is it a different thing? Because if it's a person, we got a problem on our hands because we're killing them at a rate of 3,000 a day. Not cool, is it? Do you think that should be legal to take the life of that child there? I mean, I think it depends on the It's what? I think it depends. What does it depend on? I mean, was the child wanted or was the child not wanted? A lot of kids are not wanted, um, sometimes up until the age of, as a teenager, or even beyond. But I wouldn't say that that's a good reason to take their lives. Just because the parents don't want somebody doesn't mean they're less human. This is why we do this. Please think about it. That's why we do this, man. Please think about it, okay? Why do they take those kids' lives? Because they do. Is that a kid? Those of you who said, yeah, do you know they're taking at least 4,000 a day? You live in a genocidal country. You really do. This is why we feel the way we do. Please think about it, okay? Abortion does actually kill somebody. Even from the moment of fertilization, that's a somebody. It's not just a thing. Yeah. And because it kills somebody, you know, people should have equal rights, right? right? You don't take the life of a person even if they're young. Just because, you know, you don't think you have money or you weren't ready for the child or the child is going to be disabled or something. You don't do that. this topic, like, entirely, I'm still, like, kind of vicious. If I was to have a baby that I didn't want, yes. I would want that I could not physically support. I would not have, I would not want to have the baby. You would take the it life of the kid, man. It, no, ma'am, but it would ruin that kid's life. But it's It would not. destroy that kid's life. It would destroy my life. No, ma'am, it would destroy you your lifestyle. My lifestyle? Yes. And your plans Very and your cool. goals, but not your what life. About, mm -hmm. What about kids, women who are raped? Yes, that's terrible. Should they be able to abort the child because it's not their child, it's not their choice? Well, should you be able to kill a one-year-old son of rape? Of course not. Why should you be able to kill him in the womb? Check out what we got here, you know? No. Hey, look, it, you seem to be an intelligent person. At least give us a chance to explain our side of the debate, you know? You might look at it later. You might think, wow, well, those people aren't quite so crazy. Well, then you can't blame us for... Look, I mean, if this was not a human being, we didn't firmly know this was a human being, everything you say would make sense. But this is a human being. We had sex ed last yeah. week. A zygote is not classified as a human Who told you that? My teachers. Like, all education... We are not openly targeting babies because they are babies. We are we are killing the babies because we cannot take care of them. Uh, we can't take care of them. How can people in the darkest parts of Africa still take care of their children and not complain about it with no welfare system, no help from the outside, every po every possible problem you can imagine? Well, yes. I do not need to know about this stuff. Well, then you can leave, I guess. No, but you guys. But you do need to know about it. There are other kids here that really yes. do not need to know this, and we they need absolutely to go need home, to know. You guys you are, are you're distracting us. This is well, you can leave. I'm this not going to stop you. I believe you do need to know because this is a lie that the pro-choice propaganda machine is shoveling you. This would be, it is not an adult human being. Not yet. The thing I'd have to take care of it. I can't take care of a baby. So a lot of women can't take There's care of a There's plenty of people that want to adopt kids. And but even if you can't take care of people, it doesn't mean... Of course. Because I spoke to the PTA Robinson before you start harassing all of the children. Of course not. And we're not harassing anybody. Yes, you are. You're no, harassing miss. kids. We are preaching truth. No, you guys. You guys and are And they're young cowards. adults. You guys are such cowards. We no. do this because... No, ignore these people. They're cowards. If you they're believe in free speech, no. you'll don't listen to it. Don't All right. their cards. They're religious fanatics. We're just so religious crazy. Fanatics. We're just... And you, we're going to hurt you terribly by yeah, showing you a piece of paper. If you guys actually wanted to help people, you would be Come at on, a guys. homeless Thanks, shelter guys. right now. All right. <laughs> and here's how we can help people. You guys would actually be out doing something. everybody's opinion. Absolutely. Yeah, they could voice it, but you guys are harassing children. This young lady has stood here without any harm for about... Hey, 15 yeah, minutes. I'm, I'm here right, on behalf of the parents who don't want their kids harassed. I know, harassed. and that's why we have to be here. Because no, so many pro-abortion parents will cover it up until another generation you know, is raised you like you. I'm not here attacking mothers. I'm not, I haven't pushed you're anybody. Here, I haven't even touched anybody except that guy who's, to who head to do your What do you think the school does? This is a school They're minors. indoctrinating kids. Minors. That's what, what education doing? is. You guys are here harassing kids if they get out of school. To talk to people is not harassing. sick human does that? If you want to have Should we a stop talking to her? People, okay. If no, no. Ma'am, you're going to mess with you. my camera? That is, See, that is, that is assault. Then I will stand right it. here. Okay, we're almost done. All right. Go to the vaginal assembly in Richmond. Don't stand here with minors with 14, 15, 16, and 17. Who does?
that. Are you okay, Pat? Put the places where you're wanted, not in front of all of these parents whose minor children are coming outside. Hopefully, ma'am, some of these kids here will have a, a better care. Like will be of a better character than their parents, oh, and will put an end you're to this the horrible one with thing. With the camera filming yes, minors. So what? Because you're a psychopath. Damn, that is illegal. Now knock it off. You know what's illegal? Standing outside trying to solve no, fourteen not. year olds. You guys are psycho. Absolutely messed up. Make sure. It's Ma'am, Ma that was battery now. What you're saying is that you're a Christian. Yes, miss. Think about what Jesus would do. I'm a Christian. He hung on a cross you know publicly. What? I'm a foster parent. Yes. Because I believe that it's the right thing to do to take care of kids, but this is wrong. This is what not wrong, ma'am. What we are doing is wrong. What we are doing is ending it's the so Holocaust that you and your cohorts Holocaust have ignored. It reached this girl's heart. She decided that she thought her mother and daughter was 14. And that actually ended up with the mother and father marrying and raising their own child. I agree with that the seeds we planted would germinate and would grow, Lord. And I pray that the argument we had with that young lady, I pray that she would, yes. even she would uh, think of some of the arguments, some of the points, and would start to reconsider her position and start to soften, Lord. And I just thank you for it. I thank you for keeping us safe and that that the, the, the police went in our favor. Yes. And just I pray that you would bless bless this outreach and, and uh, this time together. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.